Kanye Zidemasi, National Youth Council, Secretary for Youth as National Youth Council. As the Antonde Youth, I think we are really doing great, and we expect every young person in the Antonde District to come on 7th October 2022. And uh, the major activities, or if I may highlight what is going to take place, we shall have a youth run. Uh, as a SIMO youth run on that day, where young people will be running in town and it will help us raise money, which will help us support the activities of young people in the district. That money we will get from the run. And from that, we shall have a tree planting around the streets of the Antonde district, which we are advocating for climate change in the Antonde. As you are aware, we, as Kato Corridor, the Antonde district, we have a challenge of um, of drought so that's why we are doing that planting trees on that very day and above all we are the majority in the district and not only the district the entire country that means it is our role as youth to carry out on that activities and we act as an example to our fellow colleagues and maybe lastly we shall um, have showcasing of the young people who have gov benefited from government programs for example, we have a Mioga Youth Capital Venture Fund. We have a livelihood program where young people have benefited. But as youth of the Antonde, we have sat and agreed that well, government have been has been supporting these young uh, people, but no one is coming out to appreciate the government. And young people are losing interest from government programs. So as youth of the Antonde, we are going to show on that very day our fellow youth who have benefited. This will help other youth to engage in government programs, specifically the parish development model, which will be done at the parish level. And we encourage every youth who can to engage in government programs like parish development model. And maybe lastly, the mere fact that the Antonde it's our first time to celebrate such a youth day. We encourage each and everyone, stakeholders, youth, everyone to participate. And we've already confirmed the guest of honor as Honorable Betty Amongi, the Minister of Gender, Labor and Social Development.